Okay. I've not made a video in a while, so I decided to make this one. This one is based on my Instagram. My Instagram is at bloodyangelx, if you didn't already know. And my Instagram lately has been targeted by, I call them, I call them gremlins. And that's what they're going to be called, gremlins. So, my Instagram has been targeted by gremlins. These gremlins have been commenting on all my pictures and my posts and everything and directly messaging me, not only showing everyone but actually targeting me personally by directly messaging me shit and being quite harsh about my situation. I do understand where they're coming from sometimes. I am quite a dramatic person. But it's what's going through my head. Everything that's typed is what goes in here. This is what is messed up. And it doesn't help when I get comments and stuff like, just eat. Get over it. Kill yourself. All these horrible messages. I think it's quite disgusting actually. For me, I have quite a good community within my Instagram. Um, mine's a half recovery blog. I'm not really amazing at recovery. I'm not like these, um, I'm not like Mouse's recovery. I'm not like Iona, who is really good and posts her food. And she's actually my favorite Instagram. I can't do that, that's not me. I struggle to cope with and realise what I'm eating and I panic. That's why I can't do a food blog. But I love looking at others and they're my favourite type of Instagrams. But these are recovery blogs. And what's getting me is these horrible people targeting the recovery blogs. I'm not being funny, but go target the pro -anners. These accounts out there that are pro-anorexic promote people to go on the Alice diet too fast to get the skinny look that's so called beautiful. Apart from these people do not have anorexia. Some of them it may develop but a lot of the time these people don't have anorexia and these people aren't getting told to stop being anorexic activists because that's what they are they're promoting um, anorexia as a trend and it's not a trend it's an illness whereas recovery counts that are trying the people trying to get better and this is how they're trying are getting slated for it getting told to just get over it I'm not being funny but this helps I myself am really bad at posting. I post quite trigger warning stuff. However, this helps me express my feelings. I do not dramatise it. I do not over exaggerate. Well, no. It, it appears like I over exaggerate, but I don't. Whatever I post is what's going through here. This is what's wrong. My brain. Something is not right up there and I'm trying to fix it. And um, posting stuff that could be, yes, I admit, I do post quite triggering stuff. Triggering stuff. But this stuff and expressing this helps me not do stupid things. Because that's the worst thing is for someone who with a mental illness to keep it all up here is not good. It destroys them. It's like a bomb. My brain is like a ticking time bomb. It's a bomb that goes off loads. If I keep having stuff in there, it's like having a shed with a bomb in it. If you keep putting stuff in the shed, when the time bomb goes off, it makes more of a mess. 
that's what's in here. If I keep, um, I don't know how to explain. If I keep things, if I don't let these things out of my head, then when I get really bad and my it explodes, my bomb explodes, that's when it is the worst and when it's really bad. Anyway, um, the Instagrams. So yeah, that's it. I wanted to make this video short. It's shortish. It's not the longest video I've done. It's not the shortest, I don't think. Anyway, I'm babbling on now. Stop reporting the people trying to recover. Report the people who are promoting the illness. We may appear like we're promoting the illness. Mine especially might appear like I'm promoting the illness, but I'm not. This is my way of coping. You need to draw a line of the recovering and expression accounts to the actually promoting anorexia. So anyway, peace out. And I hope you all have a jolly good time. That was quite British then, was it not? Sorry, it was so weird. Right, I gotta go. This car was ugly. I said, bitch, where? She said, under all that makeup. I said, bitch, where?